special health report is brought to you by Union Memorial Hospital. You're not bulletproof, but uh, you never think it's going to happen to you. When the EMT came in and, and uh, started hooking up all of the wires to me and says, Mr. Holloway, you're having a heart attack. Upper Chesapeake Medical Center called me directly saying that a patient needed urgent help. We uh, uh, called the heart line and um, activated the transfer process. Medevac me down to Union Memorial. It was shock, uh, disbelief, scary. It was really scary. I remember them wheeling me out, loading me into the helicopter. I mean, the blades were turning. Once I got inside, I had no recollection of, you know, even lifting off. They flew him down here in less than 12 minutes. The flight saved his life. The pilot called me, said, we're here, and he's going into the OR. Time is muscle. The longer the heart attack is going on, the uh, more damage is being done to the heart. The patient uh, was in shock, had a balloon pump in place, and uh, was in the process of having a, a massive heart attack. Everything had to go right. Um, he was very close to death when he went in the operating room. So you have a very definite window of time where you can uh, work effectively to reverse the uh, damage that's been done to the heart and prevent additional damage being done. The top part actually moves very well. You can see the wall contracting down. And, and beating nicely, but the bottom part of your heart just sits there. It gets pulled up a little bit by the rest of the muscle that's beating, but it's not moving at all. And that's what a heart attack is. We were able to put two bypasses in the bottom of your heart and save most of that muscle. We're very fortunate that we have an expert intensive care team here that acts in concert with the surgeons, anesthesiologists, and the nurses to really kind of oversee the intensive care. Everything really happened like clockwork. Events like this can be potentially avoided. The CT scan has been a more recent tool to identify people that may have pre-existing coronary artery disease and don't know it. It really is completely um, non-invasive. It, it certainly is not something that's threatening, and the test is done fairly quickly. My fortune was that the right people were at the right place at the right time. This special health report is brought to you by Union Memorial Hospital. We are the heart specialist.